Hello, I'm Jay, owner of Volunteer Audio in Oliver Springs, Tennessee. And I am so blessed because so many of you have chosen to bring your bike to us and let us do upgrades on your audio or different things on your Harley. But quite often when somebody trailers their bike in, they go to unload it and we find out their battery is dead. And they're going, why did my battery go dead? It was great when I went to leave the house. And I have to explain, you forgot to put your bike in transport mode. So transport mode is something built into all the newer Harley Davidsons. And what it does is it cuts your security system off. So while your bike's back there in the trailer and it's all tethered down or in your biker bar and it's on its way here, you can't see it, but all your lights are flashing the whole way because it thinks somebody stole your Harley. Now, a lot of people say, well, I left my key on it or in it. That isn't always going to work because if your bike doesn't see the key, it's going to set that alarm off and your battery's going to be dead. So watch this video. I'm going to show you how to put your bike in transport mode and make it where you're not embarrassed when you go to unload. And man, come on, when you get to your vacation or the spot you want to go, you just want to unload and you want to go ride. I don't want you to have to try to figure out how to get a battery or charge it up. So watch this video and I'll show you how to save all that heartache. So the first thing I want to do, I want to familiarize you with the buttons we're going to be using. We're going to be using our ignition button, just turning it from off to on and back to off. We're also going to be using our left turn signal button, as well as what we call the flash the pass. That's where you take the high beam button up here and you just pull it toward you. That's going to flash your lights if you were passing somebody. So the very simple process, we're going to use these three buttons. First step, we're going to turn ignition on. We're going to turn it back off. Now very quickly, we're gonna press our turn signal and flash the pass at the same time. We're gonna hold it until we see this pop up on our infotainment system. So here we have a picture of our bike in the back of a truck. It says you're in transport mode. It's that easy. And the only thing you have to do to get it out of transport mode is what you would always do. Just turn the ignition on, just like you're gonna start it up and back it out and you're out of transport mode. Now this might also come in handy if you're gonna store your bike long-term. A lot of times ours sit in here because we do so much work, it's rarely that we get to start them up and go ride them. But if you're gonna let it sit for a long time, you can do this as well. It's gonna cut the security system off and it's gonna lower that battery drain on the bike. But we're always gonna recommend that you put your bike on a battery tender, it's gonna sit for a long time. But for sure, putting it in transport mode is easy and it's gonna keep you from being embarrassed when you get your new bike and you go to unload it and your battery's dead. Now, one thing to keep in mind, the early CVOs, this is a 23 and a half, if you have not updated the software in your bike yet for the infotainment system, it may not show you that indicator that you just saw. If you wanna check and see if it's in that mode, hold the trip button on the left bar. And when you turn it on and back off, it should show you that indicator on screen like it showed us the first time. So weird flaw they had in the early software, but if you have the updated software, it's gonna work exactly like you saw today in this video. This is the same method on the base model Road Glide, Street Glide, or any of the new body style CVOs. All right, thank you for watching this video. I hope we've helped you. I hope I've showed you how to keep your bike from having a dead battery and how to keep from being embarrassed or even frustrated when you get to that vacation spot or wherever it is you decided to trailer your bike to. Subscribe to Volunteer Audio, follow us on Facebook. By doing so, you're gonna see the videos as they come out. We're gonna show you a lot of cool things about your bike. We're gonna show you things like how to upgrade your audio, how to upgrade your exhaust. We've got a lot of cool things and if you're thinking about doing that, check out volunteeraudio.com because that's where we're going to have our Chromeworks exhaust, our speaker and amp upgrade packages, all these things that you probably need for your Harley already. So volunteeraudio.com. If you have any questions or need help in making those purchases, call us at 1-844-30-AUDIO. We have a great sales staff and tech support staff that'd love to take your call, answer your questions, and help you make the right decisions. Like this video by doing so, it's gonna move us up in search results. It's gonna help other people find the same video and keep them from having a dead battery as well. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, God bless.